Welcome. I'm here with Nadav Kidron, the CEO of Oramed. Nadav, thank you for joining us. How are you? Good. Thank you for having me. It's our pleasure. Um, let's get right into the exciting news you've had recently. You broke some news regarding your phase three oral insulin trial. What's the significance of reaching full enrollment? What does this mean for the company as a whole? So phase three is the last phase before you can get the marketing approval from the FDA to actually start selling the products in the United States of America. Um, we basically announced that after doing our preclinical phase one, phase two, we reached the point that the last patient went into the phase three. That's the first phase three that we have. And that means that in six months, we're going to have uh, the readout. Amazing. Okay. And now that this trial is completely enrolled, when can we expect the top line results? Do you have a time frame there? So basically from the minute that last patient started it, he's going to be, he's, he's going to be in for six months and then we're going to get the data. So we should be announcing the data in January uh, 2023. Amazing. Okay, what would be the benefits of oral insulin? Can you talk about the significance of this? Sure, sure. And we also um, we also published recently uh, a big survey that we did with Acovia that showed that doctors are really, really uh, are buying into it and very interested in seeing it already in the market because when we give it the oral insulin, the patients are actually producing less glucose by by the liver and therefore it's it's a great way to give insulin in the safest way which will allow an earlier intervention with the insulin which is basically going to allow for those hundreds of millions of, of, of people out there to be in a better health state and to prevent injections for a much longer time fantastic okay people have spoken about this in the past why doesn't it exist yet what makes your product different from what we've seen come down the line already well, Ormed has a proprietary technology that allows us to take those peptides, to take those injections and deliver them orally. So our oral insulin, after uh, tens of thousands of dosing, we've been able to show that this technology works and we know how to overcome the obstacles, which is the, the size and the degradation, and to get this insulin intact into the, into the portal vein and into the liver, and then it goes into the bloodstream. Terrific. Okay, so how is the safety of oral insulin compared to injectable insulin? Is there any significant difference there? The amazing thing about, about giving insulin orally that it goes directly first pass into the liver. And the liver is able to get a lot of insulin because most of our body's insulin is actually being stored in the liver. And therefore, so far, we've been able to show that the safety profile of the oral insulin is extremely high. So if you add to the benefit of the insulin plus the idea that the safety profile is very high, and that's why we come to a product that is very much desirable, but both the doctors and the patients. Amazing. Uh, to what other drugs can your technology be applied? Is it specifically this one or is there a further horizon beyond that? So Ormed has a platform proprietary technology that allows us to take many, many injectables and deliver them orally. So we're working on insulin. We're working now, we're showing a phase three for insulin for diabetics type two. We're also working on insulin for for people who are NASH, who suffer from fatty liver. We're also working on GLIC-1. We're also working on an oral vaccine. So this technology can be applied for a variety of many things. And once we are able to set the proof of concept with the insulin that is working very well, we can definitely apply it to more and more potential injectables. Fantastic. Okay, balance sheet. Let's talk about the financials of the company. Do you need funding near term? Are you in a well-fortified position? How does the balance sheet look? So as of the last financial report, Ormed has about $174 million in cash. We're burning about $30 million a year. So the company is actually positioned in a very, very strong as far as, as, far as the cash needs. We can move over with our plans without a need to raise uh, additional funds, which we're not going to do. Definitely not at the, the current market conditions. Terrific. Okay, wonderful information. Thank you so much for joining us, Nadav, talking about Ormed, what you guys are doing with the oral insulin and all of the things that are coming down the road. Very excited to watch it happen. Thank you.